Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix error code that is 0x00001338 in bracket 12488N. So if you're receiving this error code with Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 game on your Windows computer, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now to fix it, open Steam on your computer. On the top here, you can see help option. Go to help, then click on Steam. Now over here, scroll down. In search option, you can type in Call of Duty Warzone. Now over here, you can see Call of Duty Warzone. You have to remove this from the library. So here you can see the option which says, I want to remove, I want to permanently remove this game from my account. So if you agree, you can remove this. You can always recover it back. Um, I will show you. Uh, so you can click on it. I want to permanently remove this game from my account. And it's telling me to remove Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 as well. So it's telling me you own this product as a part of multiple packages. One is Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 and then another is Warfare 3. I want to play Warfare 3 so I will select this option. And this option has Call of Duty Warzone. So if you see that Separately, if you can remove Call of Duty Warzone, then that's good. But in my case, it's not the case. I have to remove Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 as well. So I will select that. If you see it as single, if you if you can remove it single, then you can do that. Now, I will click on OK, remove the listed game from my account permanently. So I will click on it. Here you can see the game has been permanently removed from your account. Now you can go to library and you can play the game and you should not receive this error message again. You can reopen Steam. So if still you are facing the problem, then you can exit and then you can, up, you can open the Steam once again. So let me exit. Now once Steam is up and running, uh, you can go to library and then you can launch the game and then check. Now still you are facing the problem in that case you can uninstall the game and then reinstall the game. You can try that. Now in future if you want to recover Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 and Warzone, in that case go to help once again on the top then click on Steam support and again you can search for the game Call of Duty. Warzone. Click on it. It's not in my library. Click on it. And then you can click on here. You can see. Uh, click on. Uh, I view in uh, view the product in your library or click on this option which says restore the previously removed package to my account. Here you can see the package Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 has been restored to your account. So it when you even you can search for Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. So in, in search you can type in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 and you can select Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 and then you can in it will be added to your library. And let me check if the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 has been added or not. Let me see. Call of Duty. Warfare 2. So here you can see the options are there. You can add it. In my case, uh, you can select it, then click on it's not in my library. But I think in my case, it's already added. You can even select this one. Campaign 1. It's not in my library. View product in your library. So it's already added when I selected that Call of Duty Modern, Modern Warfare 2. 
uh, when I clicked on restore, it's already added. If you want to check it, you can go to manage my DLC and you should be able to see your game over here. Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 2. So this is uh, once uh, you remove Call of Duty Warzone uh, and Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, uh, once you remove it, you can launch the game or you can restart Steam and then launch the game. If that does not work, you can uninstall and reinstall the game and then launch the game. And in future, uh, like after you play the game, you can start playing the Modern Warfare 3 game. And once done, uh, once you are done playing with the game, you can always restore the game like I've shown you. You can go to Steam support, search for the game, and then it's not in my library. Select that option and then restore the game. So this has worked for many players and that should help you to fix this error. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.